Check. All right, here we go. <laughs> All right, we're on. Family and friends, first, let me take a moment to welcome all of you to Laura and Nolan's wedding. We are gathered here, pressing pause in the craziness that is our everyday lives to be in this moment, Laura and Nolan's moment. We have come to Birmingham Country Club on this brisk fall day. Some of us are bundled in blankets. Some of you might have taken an Uber from across the country while others might have flown in from around the country. But we are all here today to celebrate Laura and Nolan's love. Today, we get to bear witness to the next chapter in their love story. This one as husband and wife. Um, I remember vividly the first discussion that I had with Nolan regarding Laura. Uh, we were at a baseball game. I think it was a Detroit Tigers baseball game. I think it was a Father's Day game. We took dad to the game. Um, and this relationship, I believe, was pretty new at that time. And the things that Nolan had to say about Laura, even at that new stage of their relationship, um, struck me. You know, you could tell even early on that she was someone that was extremely important to him. And uh, fast forward a few months later, we had the opportunity to meet Laura for the first time. And we obviously all loved her from day one. And seeing them together was such a cool thing. They were best friends. Um, their bond was strong. And you could tell that this was a relationship that was built to last. We're living in this tiny Chicago apartment and I finally get the time to spend some quality time with this beautiful man behind me, Nolan. And I have to say, when I first met Nolan, I was a little bit confused. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I'll never forget. Um, it was Lollapalooza and he was wearing a plain white all that t-shirt. Um, and I was really unsure. I was like, there is no way that someone can be this kind and this selfless and not have ulterior motives. And I think after all these years getting to know Nolan, specifically all the close contact we had in that tiny 500 square foot apartment, and I can say with full confidence that Nolan embodies the verb of loving when it comes to Laura. Nolan, I've been watching you, and, you know, you're a pretty strong person. Not physically. <laughs> and, and after yesterday, I see the golf gene left after Stefan and Dylan. But you're strong in character, and I see the way you treat Laura. I see the way you respect her. I see the way you talk to her. I see how you support her. And there's nothing more that a father could want than their daughter getting that kind of love. So thank you. Now, Laura, I mean, I could talk about her for hours, and I, I'm trying, trying to come up with one word to describe her, and that word is determined. She came, she came out of the womb determined. Determined to be heard and Laura you have just I have watched you face every challenge and every opportunity in your life and you have just turned into a hard-working successful beautiful young woman but remember you'll always be our baby so put them together and they're a pretty nice couple huh and we are all excited to see what your journey through life will bear.
being with somebody who gives you the freedom to truly be yourself and loves you unconditionally all the while is rare. And that's exactly what they have in one another. When Nolan finally popped the question, it was honestly one of the best days of my life. I can't imagine how it was for you two. Seeing you guys in Humboldt Park with your Chicago friends by your side, reggaeton bumping in the background, it was absolutely perfect. I couldn't imagine a more fitting way for you two to take that next step. Through all of this journey, Laura and Nolan have built such a strong foundation for their relationship that will last a lifetime. I think anyone who has spent time with these two know just how much love they have for one another. As a big brother, I can't begin to describe just how happy I am to know that my sister has found the love of her life in Nolan. I will trust you and honor you. I will laugh with you and cry with you. I will laugh with you and cry with you. Through the best and worst. Through the best and worst. Through the difficult and easy. Through the difficult and easy. Whatever may come, I will always be there. For whatever may come, I will always be there. I choose you as the person. I choose you as the person. With whom I will spend my life. With whom I will spend my life. For whom I will spend my life. Laura, Nolan, you did it. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Nolan, you may now kiss the bride. All right, give it up to the newlyweds.